Well, how do there, chums to Zai, captain of the steves. Now, I've been trying to get these bug heads. Yeah, and they're not seeming to spawn. Now, the way that I was doing it was by popping those vile brood grubs. But I was doing it on any old planet. I've had people saying, try doing it from the Nexus mission. Then it twigged. Maybe you need to do it from a vile brood planet. So I've scoured the 905, the No Man's Sky hub, NMSA hub of my own, in the 905 territories, and I have found one of these vile brood planets. It's the ringed planet in this system. I'm going to fly on down there. I'm going to create a base for hunting the vile brood and hopefully get their heads hung on the walls I see down at the planet after I've built myself a little shack. OK, chums, now something that I hadn't done is claim the expedition rewards. So I haven't got all my little heads to put on the walls. All these posters, let's grab those. Heads, heads, heads. I want to stick those on the walls. They're not the heads for the appearance modifier. You know, these are the ones that you stick on your wall. So there we go. Grabbed all of those. And now I'm going to go back to my base. I'll see you down at my shack that I've built. It's a bit more than a oh, shack. Do the chums. Welcome to my turtle base. So I've built a few turtles in the past. I need to do a bit of work on the legs, but I think the basic premise is there. So let me take you inside, people. Whoops, I went the wrong way. <laughs> Bandled that out and then stuffed it up. Ah, let me in. Ah. OK, here we go. So let's take a tour inside. We've got some sentinel sort of hands there, or um, autophage hands. We've got a head over here, and we've got a load of the bug heads on the wall. These are the bug heads that I'm hoping to get to change my um, appearance to. We've got like a skull on a map there, another one there. And it's just mirrored over on this side. So this is my little hunting lodge. So now we're on a vile brood planet. Hopefully I'm going to have more luck in getting some of these heads. You know what, I might put an appearance modifier in here as well, people. May as well. And then I can put the heads on as and when I get them, can't I? So we'll stick that, I don't know, just there. Cool. So the heads that I'm missing are just here. So I'm missing that one, the Hunter's Jaws, the Bioluminescent Headpiece, and the Brood Mother's Maw. So let's see if we can get those free people. Got here. Let's head on out. Now this planet has got extreme sentinels and has got extreme storms. I got thrown around in a tornado earlier when I was building my base. It wasn't funny. Well, it probably would have been if I would have recorded it. Right. OK. And I think I'm just going to try popping one of these vile brood things right here. Now, people have told me that I'm killing the boss too quickly. I need to take out some of these little guys. So we'll see how we get on. Boom. And you have got to take off all of the exoskeleton to up your chances of getting one of these headpieces. So there we go. Take that you. Take that scatterbug. Okay, he's gonna brood some more now. Here we go. Get the little ones. Reload. I could do with the plasma launcher. I don't want to use the geology cannon this close to my base. I don't want to put holes everywhere that I'm going to fall in when I come out of my base. Right, so this one's actually got the brood mother Moore's head. I don't think it matters much. I don't think it's going to make much of a difference to what I actually um, get when it comes to drops, which head is on the creature itself. Some people have said that there is a connection, but I don't know. I, I took out one the other week and when I got my very first one, it didn't have the head that I managed to get. OK, let's just replenish that quickly. Have I taken off all of the bone bits? Let's just check. Yes, I have. Oh, nearly tried to sit on me. And it's as good as dead now. Right, I'll just take out the small ones. Take that, you bug of evil. Bloom. Done. Well, I didn't get one. 
Right. Okay. Well, that's bizarre, isn't it? Still didn't get one. Well, I have been assured that they are still there, so I'm going to keep trying. Right, well there is actually a juicy grub over on yonder hill, so let's go and pick one up from the actual planet itself and then pop one and see if that makes any difference whatsoever. Uh, boom, head back over this way where it's a little bit flatter. And we'll try that now. Go to go. Like that, you. I got evil. A chow. Look that little bug. Uh, that. Yeah. Right, we've already seen me take out one, so give me a second. I'll be right back when it's about. Okay, chums, well, all of its bony bits are off, and um, I've destroyed its brood a couple of times. Let's just take it out now. Boom! Am I going to get anything? I'm checking up here. Swarm is subsiding. And no. Nothing. Hmm. Well, people say that, that this is definitely a thing, and this is a vile brood planet. The other thing that they said is to run the Nexus mission. And they got them doing that. So you know what? Let's go give that a try. Because at the moment, I'm not having any luck with this method. Heck no. So let's fly on up. To the Nexus. Let's hope that the mission okay, rolls chums. in. Luck be had it. There's one right here. Exterminate Val Brood. Let's hit that one up. Initialize mission. Start a mission. I guess. Let's go do this, people. Let's go take on the Val Brood and let's see if we get the heads this way. Okay, there we are. A little bit gutted that I didn't get them from the planet that I just had to go and find and build my little outpost. I wonder if it's going to keep me in this system or fly me somewhere else. Hmm, it's flying me somewhere else. Maybe there's certain planets that got a higher drop chance of giving these heads. I don't know. Okay, it's marked out the infested planet, and I'm flying on down. Right, we're nearing the marker, people. Zoom! Holy fudge, Anori. Look at this storm that's raging. Oh, my days. Look at the terrain. It's insane. Okay, well, let's uh, touch down here then, people. Zoom! We have arrived! Okay, duck. Mark is inside the building. Let's go on in. I'm not doing that. Right, okay. Uh, we, we just need to find some vile brood, and I've got a load of stuff on me, so you know what? I'm just going to pop one, and we'll see what happens, shall we, people? There we go. Come on, get bags. Where are they? There it is. Yeah, I got a plasma launcher now. How'd you like them apples? I haven't put any upgrades on the plasma launcher. I need to get it up to S grade. Oh, well, you're dead now. Zappity doo da, zappity da day. Another one done. Okay. Well, um, still no joy, people. Okay, let's do another one. Yeah, where is it? There. Have it. Well, I'll reconvene in a moment. Okay, he's about to pop. Let's see if we get it. Pow. Any second now? Come on. You know you want to. No. Nothing. Okay. Right. Let's go again. Right, let's reconvene in a moment. Right, chums. Now, I'm wondering whether it's affecting people differently. Like, if you started the expedition from the console, maybe you can't get the bug heads, like the way I did it. If you started it from the main title screen, maybe it's actually registered that the, the ex expedition's over for you. I really don't know. Maybe there's a reason as to why some people can't get the bug heads, and other people are getting them pretty darn freaking easy. Because, you can see here, I've taken out, what, five this episode? I've, I've not been lucky. I haven't had a head drop. I mean, we've done the mission. That didn't work. I've gone down to a vile blue planet. That didn't work. 
I've tried it on planets without vile brood just by popping the grubs. Didn't work. I've tried every single way that okay, I can think chums. of. Well, I'm back at it. I'm killing the vile brood. I've already killed one. Nothing actually happened. This has got one of the heads that's like um, an earlier head on it right now. So the last ones that I killed have been like the... the oh, actually, I've just blown the front of it off and now it's got that head underneath it. All right, fair enough. Ah, uh, well, I was hoping that there might have been an indication that perhaps I was fighting against a slightly weaker brood mother. And maybe they've got to be done in a certain order. I, I really don't know. I'm clutching at freaking straws, people in the viewerverse. Uh, now I'm just going to melt them as quickly as I possibly can. I'm just killing the ones that come close to me right now. Just to see if that makes any sort of difference. I mean, this is how I did it on the PC. I just focused on the main creature. And if anything got into my stream of shots, then I shot that too. But I, I didn't really focus on the little ones. I just took out the big one. And I managed to get the heads really quickly on my PC save. Like, no problem at all. None of this frustration. However, I did see inside the comments that people were saying, Oh, hold on. I just got a new head. So it does happen. All right. Okay. We just got one. Ha ha. I got a new head. Okay, so maybe the drop rate is extremely low or something, but it seems to be working, people. There we go, that was my seventh. That was my seventh fight. So they're not that frequent, people, but they are there. Right, I know what, one. I'm going to try and kill it as quickly as I possibly can. Maybe it's got something to do with that yellow bar at the bottom. Maybe it's some sort of timer that, you know, maybe you've got to get it done within, like, one or two cycles. I don't know. But there we go, completely hammered him then. Oh, I think a storm might have helped me, though. Dang it. All right, I might go back inside my base until the storm ends, because I think that storm just obliterated him. OK, uh, let me back in my base. Oh, no, I missed the door. Ah, help. I'm getting hit by tornadoes. I don't want to go to the land of Oz. No, it's not nice there. OK, right. I'll take shelter. Yeah, I'm back doing this one in seriously quickly. I think the bar's only gone down once. Boom, he's dead. And am I going to get rewarded with anything? No. So I don't think speed is a thing either. Okay. It just seems to be random freaking chance, people. Well, I've only got 19 of these things left. I'll do clone a load soon if, um, if I need to. Okay. Pow! Took that, you! Scatter bug of evil. Boom. Okay. Yeah, I don't think it's down to speed or anything like that. I'll just keep hammering this Boom, one. That one bites the dust. Oh, I got another head. Yes, we got the bioluminescent headpiece. And that was bug number nine. So, yeah, not, not too bad now. So nine bugs down. We've got one more to go, I think, now, people. Okie dokie. Well, let's, um, let's pop another one of these. Okay, come on, bug. Where are you? There it is. Okay, let's see if we can get okay. lucky again. And completely. You're done, mate. You're freaking done. Oh, there we go. That was bug number 10. That was two in a row. Two in a row, people. So there we go. I've now got every single different head from the brood mothers. Right, let's, let's head on in my turtle's mouth. Let's head on over to the appearance modifier. Uh, let's take a look at them. So we've got these in the heads. So I could put that one on if I wanted. Lovely. Look like something out of the Giver. Some sort of hyperzoa lord. Heck yeah. This one looks like something out of insectors. Yeah, I used to have toys called insectors when I were kids. Like, you can put your hand in them and use them like a glove. And they had, like, uh, insect riders that went on top. Very cool. Again, that looks very much like insect tours as well. Or something out of Honey, I Shrunk the Kids. We got that, which was the expedition reward. And I managed to get this one before the actual expedition started. So, you know what? I think I'm all good. I think I've got all those now. That's lovely and jubbly. Complete Amondo located. And yeah, I've um, changed some of the colours up on some of these on the wall just to make them all look different. And I've also put just the head there. I've put all my technicians in the corners. I've probably got a little bit more to do yet. These hands were floating, so I deleted the hands and just put one on this little pedestal and then a head there. Here's the heads on the opposite side. Use different colours for those just to make them look a little bit more individual. And I think this is coming on quite nice. It's my little room of death. Yes, got some big skulls over here, which I showed you before. Okay, well, there we go, people. That's pretty much everything that I've got for you, people in the viewerverse. So it was just perseverance.
Perseverance and a lot of patience. So yeah, I got through 10 of those wormy grubs and I think you do have to do it on a Val Brood planet. People say that the Val Brood mission worked for them. Maybe that's what kicked it into life. Maybe that's what made it start working for me. Maybe hit up that Val Brood mission. Maybe then put a base on that planet and do what I done. You know? But there you go. I managed to get them all. If I can do it, hopefully you guys can do it. Hopefully there's not a bug there. But until next time, people, salute to Mondo. Thank you very much for watching. Goodbye, goodbye. And goodbye again.